I like to call myself a game developer, but lately I haven't really got much done on that front. I have completely run out of ideas, but one thing I haven't run out of yet is Pokemon. <laughs> I need to complete my Pokédex, damn it! No, for real, the latest game is so much fun, but just like many other single player games, I sometimes wish I could play with my friends, that would make it even cooler. And this gives me an idea. So this week I would be designing a way to play this and really any other game in a multiplayer fashion, and then I would be coding it into reality. So yeah, we got games, we got development, I think I count that. The idea is this. For any game I can think of, I want to be able to define a list of objectives within that game and then pick a seated random assortment of them to populate the grid. Something like a bingo board that is connected to a server, where any cell can only be claimed by a single player at a time and the player that gets the most objectives out of all wins. Hey what's up, before you comment that, I kinda now know about the bingo sync website that does something very close to this. <laughs> but. This video has been in the works for a while and I didn't have time, so let's just pretend that the customization options in my app are enough to make it worth something. <laughs> anyway, enjoy. That's it! I started with a fixed 5x5 prototype but I later realized that by making the board size customizable with something like 3x3 to 8x8 for example, anything is possible. Tic-tac-toe, 4 in a row, chess, checkers, well, the latter need figuring out how they would work but I'll leave that up to you. So now I'll just define a JSON schema, basically the rules to format the game correctly in a single text file and anyone will be able to make their own custom multiplayer games without needing to write a single line of code. Now I've been using Unity C Sharp and Python since forever so it would only make sense of me to make this using one of those. Psych! I'll take this as an opportunity to learn some web development so make my new certified tech stack. React, Electron, Tailwind and Firebase. And since we all know the tech stacks in the cool sounding name, introducing the third stack. <laughs> what am I doing with my life? The app is gonna have multiple windows for the settings and gameplay. Each will have its own state and I'll use the context API in React to drive the data around. I got a board settings window working and by changing the values inside of it and then going back to the actual board, you can see that the changes are applied to the grid. Now I'll create a game setup page to load the game settings into the application. Electron runs the app using a renderer process where the UI lives and the main process where everything else happens, so I'll use an inter-process communication to make the former ask the latter to load up any file the user might want and then send the result back. Now I can define a list of objectives for my metagame and if I format it correctly it should appear in the game settings view and the board should now show a first list of objectives too. To generate the list I'm using a predefined seed that I fit to a random number generator. This is because I won't be hosting all the objectives and images on the server but only the player state of the grid. So players will be able to choose whether they want to use the same seed or play with different objectives. One thing I can do to make this even cooler though is try and render the application transparently and only show the actual board on the screen. This way if someone wants to play it say on stream, they should be able to integrate it quite easily with their overlays. Well I couldn't really find any creators to play Pokemon with, but my friends BlankDev and Daikozo came through and we played Zelda and Sardew Valley, so here's some of that. Okay I'm super excited, I love this. <laughs> Great Plateau is quite boring, I think, once you've done it a few times. This makes it so much more fun. Oh god, okay, I forgot, I'm speedrunning, gotta go. Okay, I got the apple. Okay, well now I feel bad, but... Got the axe. I, oh fuck, I got it too, I forgot. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I want, okay, I killed the bug goblin though. Are you on the tower yet? I've just activated it. No. It's super competitive. <laughs> it's competitive Zelda, I've never played it. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna take oh, it wait, back no, and oh fuck! You, you were free. I was about to steal it. I was about to steal it. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, I had it for so long. Yeah, I was and I just had silent. I was. <laughs> God, all the all the chat the old man does. Come on, they don't he's care. a chatter. Yeah. <laughs> God, his ABC is down. Always be chatting. <laughs> You're a brutal man. Oh shit! I shoot you. Done. No! No! Oh my god, I ate all the bass. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> no! Okay, no! That sucks. I for just pressed you. one button and ate all the chilies. Here, we could try video. another one if you want to. I'm happy to go for another one now. Two. One. one. Good luck, let's go. go. Okay, give me to lose. Alright, what am I gonna do? Oh shit, I'm. No, I didn't prepare for this. <laughs> 
Okay, 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 okay. This right. is gonna be. We are gonna have to hurry up. Um, Fuzi says loser had to, has to smash an egg on their face. Okay, I, I, well, it doesn't really work that well for you. <laughs> but you know, my face reveal can be smashing egg on face. Okay, I gave uh, any uh, gift to Linus. To Linus. Up, uh, up! Uh, I got one to Gus. Frick. Wait, I can talk to Shane. Come here. Shit! Just talk to me. Where what? is he? Where is he? Why can't I talk Where to him? My chat's and telling I me to. Am, and I my am. My telling me to. I am talking to Demetrius. Right, okay, talking. I'm talking to Demetrius. Okay. okay. Are we selling to the bin or to Pierre? I'm selling to the bin. Okay, great. Oh no! Okay. I was just about to <laughs> mark that off. <laughs> oh freak you! Yeah. Okay. I just okay, put it in okay, the bin okay. as you were putting it in. Why do the townspeople okay, have morals? Okay, I got a gift for Willy. Oh, I was just gonna go do that. Yeah, Alex is a loser. Ale look, Alex looks mean... like the person that would bully me in middle school, so I try to avoid him when I play. Same. <laughs> he, he's he's terrifying. It's a waste the entire uh, day. What if I oh, 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 he actually moved. He's actually moving. He's actually moving. Okay, great stuff. Great stuff. Yes. Hey, a gift to George. Wait, isn't the Georgia? Does he love the Georgia Cola? That might be Shane. That I'm not might sure. Might be Shane. Oh, 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 oh! I am a dumbass. Right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 14. ten, eleven, twelve. Oh, you just you won. You won. Hey. <laughs> there's a there's no need it. going on with this. <laughs> <laughs> Well, that's it. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to check out the first beta version of Stream Bingo, make sure to check the link in the description. Also, thank you so much to BlankDev and Daikozo for helping me make this video. And yeah, check them out on YouTube as well. Why not? Make sure you drop by the stream at twitch.tv slash moneymore. That's twitch.tv slash moneymore. And yeah, again, thank you so much for watching. I've been Pita. You've been amazing. And in case you decide to stick around, see you next time.